Hi my loves, how are you? Welcome back to another monthly plan with me. Today we'll be planning out the month of February. This is a kit from Temp Love Crafts, which by the way, it's a new shop for me and I am loving her monthly sticker kits. I actually purchased one for January for my personal planner and I really did enjoy it. So I wanted to get a new one for this recollection coil planner and I purchased her Erin Condren one so it could most likely work for this planner. So as you can see it comes with three pages so basically everything you will need to do your monthly. So let's start off by covering the banner and I know this banner is kind of wider because of the dates of the well, the days of the week are lower, so I had to use a lot of whiteout last month. So this month, I'm hoping I wouldn't need to. Well, I wouldn't need to, but it turned out that I will need to cover a lot of space. So once I put this double box, double box, like a double banner to cover the days from January, I noticed there is a bunch of room left over. So I figured out a different trick, which worked out way better than using whiteout. I just took some extra scrap of sticker paper and cut into size and put it behind it. Now I do have a little gap here and there that I would need to cover with whiteout, but it's fine. And yes, I know I cut that strip there so quickly. But anyway, so yeah, that's what I did. And if you don't have sticker paper, you could use like copy paper, printer paper, and do the same. And just use either double-sided tape or like glue stick. So I think that turned out awesome. So now I'm going to go ahead and cover the days that belongs to March. And she had these floral patterns, but I actually liked it turning it upside down. For some reason, to me, it looks better. So it's like more pleasing to my eye. It might not be for yours, but I actually like it upside down. It makes more sense to me how the flowers look. I know, I am weird, but that's okay. It's me. And yeah, I like how it looked in my planner. So, once I got those down, I'm going to go ahead and move on to my sidebar. This kit comes with four sidebar boxes, and I actually never worked with any of these type of boxes because the kit I used last month didn't come with any. So, I'm hoping that it reaches all the way down to the end because where that pink box is, is actually ripped, and I want it to cover it so you can't see it. And to my surprise, it actually did. I don't care that it has pink peeking through. I don't know what I would do with the bottom two boxes yet, but I'm sure I could figure out something. So now I'm going to go ahead and block off, well not block off, but actually put the holidays that she provided with this kit. And she has four in total, which is Mardi Gras, President's Day, um, Valentine's Day and Groundhog Day. So I'm going to place those and I really like that her quarter boxes are a nice size that it's not tiny. Like her font on these boxes are not tiny and you could see it from afar, which I like because I'm blind. So I'm just showing you there that you have strips to use. I don't need any of those, but I'm glad that they're provided for people who do. So I'm going to go ahead and work on my bills. Now what I noticed with these kits, also the, with the kits I did use in the past, they don't really come with icons that mention like normal every monthly bills. Like for instance, there is no icon for water bill, your light bill, your gas bill, and etc. So I have to go ahead and be creative and try to figure out what I could use so that way I can remember what each flag represents. So now one thing I didn't tell you earlier that I did not want to use her actual number, well they're not dots, they're squares, because this month my numbers are in pink. Well the number flags are in pink and I think it worked out perfectly so I'm going to skip on that tedious task of putting down every single sticker in this two-page layout so what I'm doing now is that I noticed for some reason I didn't notice before that she does provide bill due flags so all the bills that I use with the blank 
flags, I'm taking them out and putting them down so that I can remember what are the main bills of the month. As for this one I'm going to put down and also a gold one later is to represent my monthly cell bill. Mine's and my son because we do have our bills on, well, the monthly bill is due on different days, but I still pay for both of them, so I have to make sure I remember to pay not only mine, but his as well. And later on, off camera, I will put an icon of a cell phone to remind me what are those flags are for. I am trying to go ahead and use these quarter boxes that are meant for either appointments or any special days. I'm using this black one here to represent my appointment for my rheumatologist. I have another injection. I basically have one every month. So this one is for my right knee and it's for fake cartilage. It's not going to be for cortisone to try to help out the empty spaces that I have in my knee. If you have any questions on that, I do have a vlog video on this channel stating how what I went through and how does it look in case you are going to go through it, you or someone in your family. So go ahead and check that out. I'm going to link that down below. So now I'm going to use this pencil from myplanner.com to indicate that my son does not have school on the 21st because some, I guess a teacher conference or in teacher day, something like that. And it's going to be great for him because he has a four day weekend because the day before is also no school because of President's Day. So now I'm just taking out some My Planner MV balloons to indicate the birthdays of this month. I actually have three and I missed one and I'm so sorry, but I did fill it out off camera. So the first one I'm going to indicate here is my father's on the 5th so I'm using this black flag and this black balloon with this red gift box to indicate that on my planner and also on the 22nd it's my son's birthday oh my god my son is growing up so fast and I'm like oh no I don't want him to <laughs> but it's part of life So I'm going to use this gold one here to indicate that, but instead of using just one balloon, I'm going to actually, um, I guess, block out the box on both ends with the black balloons. And I'm just going to fill that in, obviously, after. So I think that is it for my month. And yeah, I really do like this kit. I do love this shop. I'm going to go ahead and... Um, leave her link down below so yeah I cannot wait to do my personal planner one as well so if you like this video please go ahead and give me a thumbs up if you're not a subscriber please go ahead and subscribe down below and remember I love each and every one of you and I will see you in my next video bye bye